little ambient machine here. Hi guys. Um, yeah, today I want to talk about something I was wondering about uh, a little while ago. I, I, um, I made a thread for Instagram asking myself if the original cloud sounds better than a clone. Um, why? Because I had many clones. I had, I think, uh, three different monsoons uh, from uh, after um, after later audio from Tomatec. I had a U burst, uh, and now I have a monsoon from Big T Music Ltd. Uh, but I was always wondering, um, yeah, and, and I was always thinking that the clones didn't sound all that good. So all the time when I sold my clouds and bought an, uh, a clone, I was like, like, no, this is just not it. And um, yeah, it, to me, it didn't sound that good. And uh, yeah, I was wondering, is this just a placebo effect or can it be true? Because maybe the components in a clone are different from the components in an original clouds. So I really didn't know that and I couldn't compare it because uh, I never had a normal clouds and a monsoon next to each other. But today I do. So I have an original cloud with a black panel and the black panel you can buy at dustyclouds.com. Um, or is it dusty clouds? Oh yeah, it's dusty minus clouds.com. I don't know if you can see it, but it's here. Anyway, if you want to know where, then you just write me uh, a PM and uh, I will give you the address. Uh, this guy makes a lot of nice black panels. So remember, dusty-clouds.com. Anyway, it's an original factory built clouds. And then I have a beautiful monsoon. I think this is the nicest one because it has the big knobs. The monsoon from Big T LTD Music. Um, of Big T Music LTD, I'm sorry. I really like the design of it and it's it's very hands-on. So uh, we are going to compare the monsoon and the clouds together. Uh, I'm going to make a little setup to do that. And um, yeah, I'll be back in a, in a minute and then we'll see if they are, are sounding the same. So here we are, um, I made a little setup with uh, the melodizer sequencing the surface, signal is being split going into the monsoon and into the clouds original and the outputs are as follows, the monsoon is the upper knob and the original clouds is the bottom knob. There's already reverb on the original clouds. So, okay, let's start the first compare and put some reverb also in the uh, monsoon. Okay, now the monsoon. actually sound exactly the same okay so now we are going to turn up the pitch all the way to the right same for monsoon all the way to the right and we're going to throw in some wet signal just a little bit we do the same here with the normal clouds a little bit wet signal like this they are about the same. It's hard to tell if they are exactly the same, but we have to deal with that. Uh, then we have to turn the density all the way up. And I will do the same here for the normal clouds. So let's hear the monsoon first. sounds horrible but I mean it's just to compare them and 
and again they sound exactly the same. So now I'm going to enter some texture. I will turn the texture all the way up here and here I will turn it all the way to the right. And let's see how the monsoon sounds. <laughs> And now we go to original clouds. And again they sound exactly the same. So now I'm going to play a little bit with the position and the size, which is uh, here and here. I will do the monsoon first. Okay, now we're going to do the same with clouds. <laughs> well, it's very hard to uh, to get the same uh, the same way of the knobs uh, uh, position get the same position of the knob so I'll just turn the density all the way to the right uh, it's easier I think to compare it like that <laughs> Sounds the same. Yeah, it sounds the same. It's kind of fair to say that they sound the same so far. Let's see what the stereo signal is doing. I'm going to uh, turn the wet all the way up by, for both. Same here. And then I will turn the density a little bit to the center. So you, listen, you, can, you can hear just a little bit of it. I will start with the monsoon again. Um, oh yeah, of course. <laughs> And then the stereo. Now I do the same for the clouds. Density a little bit to the right. And then the stereo on. It sounds exactly the same, so no worries there. Um, now I can freeze the signal. Let's freeze it together. One, two, go. Let's see what happens now. Same. Right, this one is just a little bit. <laughs> Yeah, okay. This is the monsoon and this is the... I hear some difference here. Size all the way up, position down. Size all the way up, position down. This is original clouds and this is again the monsoon. So we're going to do one more small test. I will turn these off. We go to a different sample modus. So let's take the, the lowest one. Same goes for this one. Go to the lowest one. Okay, now we're going to do the same thing again. I'm going to, to press the freeze button. One, two, boom. Let's see what happens now. Uh, 
and then the clouds ah. sorry guys <laughs> and dark. Let's see if we can do the same here. Okay, the only thing we need now is some Geiger artwork. But again, this one is a little bit up, but I mean, this has to do with the freeze button and the knob, uh, the knob positions. But yeah, in the end, it's uh, fair to say that um, a monsoon, at least the big T monsoon, uh, sounds exactly the same as clouds. So, mission accomplished. I really, really hope that this information is uh, super useful for you. And uh, enjoy, enjoy. You can just buy... Uh, uh, a cloned clouds although there are a lot of uh, original clouds now on the second hand market i don't know why people are selling it because i still think clouds uh, yeah you should have clouds and beads both so you know a lot of guys they sold their clouds to buy beads but i think these are just two different modules and i still still really love clouds so anyway have a good one thanks for watching talk to you next time bye bye